Um, so congratulations, Jay. It is honestly so exciting and rather bittersweet that Mia's story has now come to an end with Dark Dawn. But for those who haven't had the chance to devour it in the last two days, could you tell us a little bit about the book and what people can expect? Has, has anyone here read it yet? A couple of you? All right. well, I'm, I'm glad you showed up anyway. Uh, so it is essentially... Uh, who here hasn't read God's Rev? Anyone? Did anyone show up to a book launch for a third book in a series that haven't read the second one? <laughs> like two of you? Three of you? I All right. It's hard to talk about the third book without spoiling the second one a little bit. But basically the third book is the culmination of Mia's revenge journey and also the culmination of the, I guess, the meta-mystery of the world of Atreya uh, in the sense what the Darken are and what the origin of Mia's shadow powers are and the resolution of the conflict between the God of Light and the Goddess of Night. Um, Mia has to rescue her mentor. I'm trying really hard not to spoil it for you. <laughs> uh, she has to rescue her okay. mentor from the Red Church uh, with the help of some incompatible travelling companions. <laughs> it interestingly. Yeah. Um, I wanted to take a quick stroll down memory lane and share some of the things that your readers have been saying about the series on Goodreads so far. Is this like one star reviews? No, no. <laughs> They're five star, but they could sound like one star. <laughs> one star reviews are way better. <laughs> so we have a Simple, This Was Epic. Your soul will probably need a purifying mask after this. <laughs> One, I can't believe I've been able to survive my meaningless life for so long without having read this. And two, I can't believe I was able to survive reading this book because it quite nearly destroyed me. <laughs> Be prepared to have your trust and your heart stamped on with salt and vinegar poured on for good measure. <laughs> and I was punched in the gut and then Christoph reached his darned hand into my chest and yanked my still beating heart out. All the blood pulling, <laughs> with all the blood pulling beneath my clubs collapsed body. <laughs> so it sure does sound like you're torturing a lot of readers with this series, um, but I think it's safe to say that it's a pain worth enduring as you've done such a fantastic job of crafting this really rich world and populating it with really fascinating and sometimes quite lovable, like unsurprisingly, no surprisingly lovable, lovable characters like 